Let us move on to our next topic, the Uniform Price Auction for U.S. Treasury Securities. In this lecture, we will focus on learning how the primary auction for Treasury Securities actually works. We will go through a mathematical illustration of an auction so that you understand the detailed mechanics of the auction. The auction for U.S. Treasuries is conducted through a single price auction method, also called the Uniform Price Auction Method. Potential investors submit competitive and non-competitive bids. Non-competitive bids are typically received from individuals in smaller institutions and are typically in smaller bid amounts. Let us look at an example to see how it works. Let us say the Treasury announces the auction of $50 million of two-year Treasury notes and receives $10 million of non-competitive bids. That leaves $40 million to be awarded to the competitive bidders. Investor A submits a bid of $25 million at a yield of 1.2%. Investor B submits a bid of $10 million at a yield of 1.3%. Investor C submits a bid of $10 million at a yield of 1.4%. And finally, Investor D submits a bid of $15 million at a yield of 1.5%. Firstly, Investor A, as the most competitive bidder, gets awarded the full bid amount of $25 million. Investor B, having submitted the next most competitive yield, gets awarded the full bid amount of $10 million. With $35 million of treasuries awarded and $5 million remaining, Investor C gets awarded the remaining $5 million out of his bid amount of $10 million. Since Investor C bid yield of 1.4% is the stop-out yield, all the accepted bids from Investors A, B, and C are provided a yield of 1.4%. You can see that all successful investors have essentially obtained the same yield. Hence, this auction type is called a uniform price auction method. Since Investor D's bid yield of 1.5% was higher than the stopout yield of 1.4%, Investor D does not get awarded any treasuries at the auction. Hope that example gives you a good idea of how a uniform price auction works. Also, do not forget to read our detailed note on analyzing Treasury auction results, which are published on the Treasury Direct website. To keep on top of the U.S. Treasury market, make sure you follow the auctions and the results at the links provided in the article on our website.